Hi everyone, my name is Finis, and today I will be pro doing another program session with you. Um, one of my hobbies is I like to listen to a lot of music, either when I'm studying, doing homework, um, working out, or even when I'm, you know, taking a shower. <laughs> you know, it feels more relaxing that way. And I would like to uh, make different playlists. For different moods I'm in, so like for studying mood, again, I got my studying music, I got my workout music, and I got my, you know, just my chill, happy music when I'm taking a shower. <laughs> and I'm going to actually do is create a playlist using C++. And to create that playlist, we're going to be using a do while loop and storing that inside a vector. And then... We also probably want to display what songs are in our little playlist. So let's actually get started with that. So first, we want to get call in our basics. So we include iostream. We also are creating the vector, so we're going to include vector. Uh huh, and I'm gonna be using namespace. I see. Cool. And then we'll be calling our main function. Return. Oops, spell that wrong. Return. <laughs> I spell it again. <laughs> return. <laughs> it says spell return in my head, just so you know. Get all right, make a little bit more space because you know, I'm like that. Anyways, let's actually start writing this baby code on. So, obviously, since we're storing our names, um, song names inside a vector, we'll be calling for a string variable and the string, let's we'll call it a list. Mm -hmm. And then we'll be calling for a vector, a vector be a string type vector, and we'll name this vector songs. Cool. Um, let's actually just create our do while loop. So, in this do while, oh well, a do while loop, do while loop is a loop that will continue, will continue until. A, an exit statement is said. So, in this do while loop, it will do this. Uh, fun, it will do this um, problem as long as the user does not input the exit exit parameters or exit, I guess statement. So, first, we're going to do is we're going to greet the customer. You know, make a little. UI user interface. Let's say see out. Hello. You don't scream at their face because you're happy <laughs> they're here. Um, please name our songs for this playlist. And then we want to say to no say and done say quit. Pretty simple. And we're gonna end it right over there. Nice. We do get line. CN for list. And then we want to call on our vector to store our string, our string, our, our user's input for list into our vector. So I, we're going to call on our vector name first, which is going to be songs dot push back list. Cool. All right, that's all. That's all there's to it. 
Now we're going to add the parameter for, or at least the condition for this loop. And it's going to do this do while loop as long as list does not equal quit. Obviously, we want the user to see the names on the playlist. Like, you don't want to, like, you know, not know what songs you added, right? So, let's actually do, this is where we're going to create a, I guess, a for loop. <laughs> okay, let's get this started. So, for the for loop, we're going to do doing songs. Dot pop back. Do the CL. Here is what is what no actually. Let's say you have this many songs to your playlist. And we can do songs dot size. And then we're gonna end line. There we go. And now let's actually write the for loop. So do for loop. And we do oh, it's gonna be equal to zero. Alright, yeah. and then we're gonna do I is gonna be do song size. And then we're going to do i or index to what else? Cool. And then we can do c out. This is going to be basically a calendar for the number of songs and it will display to the user. So I'm going to do c out index plus one, we don't want it to start from zero, we want to actually start from one, so we're gonna add one, and it's gonna keep adding one for each list in the song. So one, two, three, four, and five, right? Add one, and it's gonna do, we're gonna add a period after that with a space. In that space, we're gonna do, Songs index of I. We're gonna end line. Here we go, and it should be able to work if we do it that way. Hello, please name your songs for this playlist. When done, say quit. So, what are very crazy songs? out there so let's do I don't know <laughs> I just listen to every part of song. oh you know it's really uh, Kung Fu Panda it's a soundtrack it's pretty nice let's add that then let's do what else songs are out there mm -hmm. counting stars Love that song. And then let's do another one. Let's say, can I think of the top of my head? Uh, Baby by Justin B. <laughs> by Justin Bieber. All right, and let's end the program right there, quick. And it should say, you have this many songs in your playlist, three. And it says, I have Kung Fu Panda, Soundtrack, um, Counting Stars, and Baby. And that's basically, how we make a playlist using C++. Thank you.